What's up guys, Josh here with Fiber Whip Magnets. Today, metal detecting this park. Great big park. Got a tot lot area with some uh, wood shavings and lots of field space. So definitely gonna be hitting this hard. All right, first find right on the edge of the tot lot here. Just see it poking out. Uh, there's a quarter. South Carolina State Quarter. Starting off pretty strong. I like that. Next signal right here. Oh, there it is. Another coin. Looks like it's going to be another penny. I'll take it. All right, I put the plug back in and then I took it out because I was getting another signal. It looks like right here is another coin and that's gonna be another penny. Nice little coin spill right there. Always double check your holes, guys. Always double check them. See, two pennies now. All right, signal here in the sidewall. And it's a rusty old bottle cap, or a bottle opener. That was ringing up the same as a quarter. Let's see. Well, now it's not. Is there something else there? Where's my quarter? Oh, there it is, 29. 28, 29. So yeah, same as a quarter. It's actually, I could still use that. Throw a new key ring on there. What's up everybody, Josh here with 508 Magnets. I'm gonna be doing some metal detecting today. I'm not alone. My beautiful Hi. wife, Angie. We got Wicked Digger again. And of course, Rocked and Magnet What's Fisher. up everybody? <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna hit this property. What's it from the 1800s? 1800s, yes. Dates back to 1800s. We got some uh, grassland, some yard area. We got some woodlot. We even got some construction area. There's lots of stuff going on here. Hopefully, you're gonna find some really good stuff. So let's get to swinging. All right, got our first signal here. Oh, tin foil. Okay. Usually, I always start with trash. Got a real nice, solid 26, 27, and it's pretty shallow. Oh no! That's why it was nice and loud. Can bottom. It's some sort of cool old bottle. Angie thinks it might be a salad dressing. I think she might be right. A lot of old bottles back here. So this is the construction area here. I just found this neat old iron uh, decorative piece. Not sure what it would have went to, but Kind of cool. We're kind of striking out, but we're kind of finding some cool old bottles and stuff. What do you got? Some type of jar. A little jar. Looks like uh, Grey Poupon. Design P A T D. Design okay. patent. Very helpful. <laughs> yeah, this is a lot of cool old bottles and stuff here. Look at that one. That's cool. I would say that's like a chemical, like a cleaner. There's stuff here. We just got to find it. Here's another little bottle. Oh, just the top of it. All right, this ground is really rocky and turns out I just dug through a glass bottle. It says ball. There's lots of broken glass here and I'm assuming, yep, that there was going to be a bottle top on the bottle. Looks like Heinz. 
That's an old ketchup bottle, or what would have been if I didn't smash it to get to pieces, but it says Heinz right on there. It's full of mud. I'm finding history, just not the coins or relics that I was hoping for. All right, I've been finding almost nothing but trash. Pretty much nothing but trash. I just found an old beer top, and this is the backside, but you can read Narragansett. So it's an old, an old uh, Narragansett lager type of beer from Massachusetts. So pretty cool. At least I can identify it. Still searching though. Good signals are few and far between right now. I right, just found an old square nail. Definitely seen better days, but it's history. First pull tab of the day, old lever tail. We are not having much luck. This is 508's over there. Brockton's over there. Wicked's off in the woods somewhere. I'm not sure where he went. Hi guys, uh, we didn't really find too much here today, but I was gonna show off what we got. We got a whole bunch of uh, old nails here. This really big guy. It's kind of like a straight top. Um, and all these little ones, they were all mixed. There's one with a spot that had like three together. Um, so a variety of that. And then we found this little salt shaker lid. And this guy was like right on top of the ground. That's cool, that might be the best find of the day. Um, it had some of the bottle with it, but it broke up in my bag, so this was kind of the top of the bottle. It was in one piece, um, and was still attached to the bottom here. That's about what we got. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, today didn't pan out so well. Um, we didn't get too much into the woods. It was kind of hard to maneuver and stuff, but we, uh... <laughs> Got out digging, had some fun outside, so. All right, um, I don't really have anything to show. A bunch of aluminum stuff. So, Angie definitely wins for today with her salt shaker lid. I did get that ketchup bottle, that was kind of cool. Um, yeah, anyways guys, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button down below. And we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.